Good morning, YouTube. I'm here with the one and only. Good morning. Good morning, Marky. How you doing, Eddie? Good, good. Well, it is the last Saturday of July. I don't know where it went. Uh, and it's uh, it just keeps it keeps flying by. It's going to be a nice day. It's uh, humidity finally dropped here in oh. western Pennsylvania. Uh, it was a brutal couple days here this week. It was the humidity was just killer, unbearable, mm. and you wouldn't want to work for a living then. You know? No, it'd yeah. be terrible. No work. Um, I got the new lines. Um, everybody has sent me a bunch of comments on our oil leak or fuel leak into the oil. These are some people call these crossover lines. These are actually the fuel lines that go from the fuel rail to the injector. There's two per cylinder. And I had found a company down in Louisiana, and it's K and S Diesel Services. Yeah. And a big shout out to Stephen. Um, you talk about a helpful company. Everybody was pointing me towards the fuel pump, um, different things. So I went to order the fuel pump, and he says, if you want me to sell you a fuel pump, I'll sell you one, but he goes, it's not going to fix your problem. So, Good we, honest business, Good man. honest business. So he told me the lines are probably the problem, but he says, also, he said, you need to pressure test it. I said, well, how would I do that? So he sold me this little pump. Um, he said, you take that up to 80 pounds, and then you'll find the leaks if, they're, if they are there. He said, them lines will split and crack. They're just the flare fittings, all they are. Yeah. And uh, I changed out four of those injectors, so who knows? That that could have been when it happened. He, he says, always pressure test them. So we're going to give that a try and see if we can get the uh, thing stopped. And also, we bought a new tachometer, so now we we, we can actually see what, what exactly. speed the old bus motor is spinning at and um, keep hours on it, too. So it has an hour change. meter. Yeah. Yeah. So um, enough of that. What else we got going today? Well, if we ever get this order cut every time we get it just about close somebody needs a few pieces they need, of it. and they, they come in they, they take it out of the pile but they pay us but uh, yeah. and then we go back well, we, we did get some logs this week so uh, that was some good news uh, we were just about out of 12 foot long pin oaks and you hate to start cutting grade lumber into yeah. decking so pin oaks are good strong wood for deck well I guess we better get moving for we're not getting anything, anything done. done like this no, just talking not. all right let's, let's get, get it out Alrighty, let's get this show started. And today we are back to our decking. Uh, we just can't get enough of it. Every time we cut some, they come and pick our pow. And the order just seems to never get filled. So we'll get her eventually. I have confidence. But uh, this is some really nice pin oak. Um, It'll actually be a pleasure to saw. So let's uh my hydros until they warm up, they make a bunch of noise anymore. That might be another problem. Wait a taper out on that uh, so let's bump this out a little bit on the front and again what you gain on one side you absolutely lose on the back side Being a little bit slow reacting today, but it'll all warm up. Takes a few cuts. Eddie's looking at the tachometer out there. Uh, we never knew really what was going on at that saw speed. We're going to have to 
bump it up a little bit, but I gotta make a new throttle cable, I'll show you sometime. I'm gonna pull one more piece of one by off of that. And then we'll start dealing with this log. That'll get us a couple pieces of one by six we need to fill this order. A lot of two by we need. And that is perfect. But you can see it's pinned out. You got that crazy power to it. Alright, being it's a big log, we're gonna lay it down. get a shoulder on it. There it goes. And I'm going to leave the taper out temporarily here until we get two corners square. Then we'll retract the tapers. We give it a little bit more. Got a good hold on at this. Whittle this away a little bit. Let him get it up out of there. And we're not in a hurry. Beautiful day. I'm going to take a sliver off her to get to a six inch face. The laser will get you close, but not as accurate as you'd think. Now I can edge something out of that. And now we're going to turn it. What we're trying to do is get down to a 12 and a quarter inch cam. I think Eddie was saying it was thin, I don't know. Under there, Eddie. Yeah, is it good? Oh, there it is. I see it. There's a good old chunk of bark underneath there. So we'll get it out of there. Looks good. A little bit of dirt. That'll work. taper back and like I said what you gain on one side you do lose on the other so that's just the way that works all right we're dog down and let's get this down to a 12 inch parallel camp I 
Okay, it took a little bit more, but we're not worried about it. Listen that bus mower, Louie. That old bus mower is liking this oak. Actually pretty for pin oak. But I never really like working with it. that other face off. Then we're taking down our 12 and a quarter. But yeah, you gotta have a plan when you get into a log. And always get past the blade when they're gonna break something off like that. lay her down and cut that face off of there. And then we'll have a big block. All right. And these are a little harder to turn when they become rectangular like that. about that a little bit chewing up but that don't bother me in the least all right we got the dog fit in and we're gonna trim that back side off of there first otherwise it'll be a big fat piece And that swing saw will chop up just about anything you put at it, but why push your luck? one will take off of the one by and then that face that's all chewed up on top we're gonna put that towards the saw again yeah we got a little suction problem going on back there hoping to get through this log without no problems, but... Alright, let's turn this thing around. Yeah. These were incredibly heavy logs. He's going to pull the... Uh... We got a little suction problem going on here, so... We're gonna look at our sawdust pit here real quick. Yeah, we jammed up here. Yep.
uh, she's starting to pull it. Let me shut this other gate off. See how fast it builds up too. Give me a sticker. We're gonna do a video like John does. What you see is what you get. She plugged up good. All right, we're back. And we got rid of the park problem. There was just a couple big pieces right on that 90. And every few months, it gets enough in there. So we're going to go ahead and put you guys back in the camera holder here. And... We're going to see if we can uh, finish this log up. A little excitement today. All right, Eddie, I'm firing her up. All right. Yeah, it's a bad day when your sawdust blower don't work, so. Let's get back to it. Didn't lose too much time. Okay, I'm going to shove that back a little bit. Pick it up here, and we'll give it all stomp on the pedal. I think you understand that the amount of sawdust this thing produces in a big hurry. Eddie says take a shim off of it. And he can see more of what's going on down there than I can. So we're going to do what Eddie says. We're not going to argue. And the bark was not from this log, it was from uh, past sawing. And we're almost down to our 12 inches, 12 and a quarter that is. And there's, there's with the pin out, you start to see the knots appear, and, and that's how oh, good we're, at, uh, we're right where we need to be. We can split this perfectly. All right, let's lay her down and start killing off some two the twelves. And now we're gonna split them. So what I'm gonna do here, Put the dogs in, back it up. I believe we are somewhere around 17 or 18 inches on that can. Boom! All right, we're dog down good. Bring it up to the saw and start over. Stuff. 
full two inch to give Eddie the signal. We need, uh, I can't look at the list right now while I'm sawing, but. So let me look here. Two by sixes, I need nine of them. See this log's moving a little bit. And they're putting back to the pile what they stole out of. Eight of these buggers. down to the final two inches. Conveyor off. Yeah, 
that thing was just thumping off the edge of that and I was like, oh boy. Don't want to replace the belt. So many things can go wrong real fast. Alright, we're gonna take this down to six. And we'll have our two by sixes. We're going to let you guys go here. And we'll talk to you in a little bit. All right. Well, we got the the big order done. And uh, I, I was really doubting that for a minute. We were going to pull that out of there, but we did. And Just then, to the board. And then well, we got, we got uh, seven pieces of that other order. And, it, you know, it's hard to believe that a board... An inch and a half versus two inches is that much difference in, in weight. But uh, yeah, there's the <laughs> there's the eight pieces we had to replace off of this order, and uh, we can't win every time we cut. Uh, and a swing saw, <clears throat> I'm going to send this blade out, uh, get it sharpened this week, because next week, and I'm going to go back up and start tearing that house apart. So. We're gonna take a we're gonna take a week to get some other stuff done, but there's uh, a nice load of uh, kindling and good slab wood, good hardwood there. And then there's the big pile back there. I don't know if you can see that, but uh, yeah, the old loader's working out very good for us. Uh, but yeah, this this order's ready to go out the door, and it just takes a while to accumulate all these pieces. But all right. Get her done. Yeah, we get her done. So, everybody also uh, forgot to tell you, we made it to 42,400 and I think it's 78 wow. or something like that. We appreciate every one of them. So, yeah, we are we are approaching 50,000. I think we can hit our goal. I hope we get it by the end of the year. We, we tried for July 4th. It didn't happen. Mm -hmm. So, if, if everybody really likes this video or our channel, please share it with someone and have them subscribe. And let's get this thing up to 50,000. Only and, takes a uh, second. And if you did not like this video, send it to <laughs> someone you don't like. That just to annoy them. To... John, I'm sorry. I have to steal that one. Yeah. 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 It's, it's, it's a good one. But uh, And everybody have a great week. And we will see you Friday Eve. Thank you. Bye-bye.